Welcome, 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 welcome to this special, special, special full moon general war integrated total body training system. Yours truly, Adrian H. Will do perform my 180th session of this general war integrated total body training system. Start the clock with 93 minutes and get going. You got 93 minutes to complete, do 100 push ups, 100 squats, 100 hocks, 100 each, 100 times 3, the trinity of hocks, push ups, and squats. Maximum 13 repetitions per set, minimum 3 in between each set, whether you do 13 maximum. Three minimum or anywhere in between, whether you do squats, push ups, hocks in whatever order, whether you complete 100 squats first and then move to the next, or that whatever combination you choose, desire. But you gotta march, jog, walk fast pace, a minimum of 31 seconds in between each set, whether you do squats, push ups, hocks, and whether you do 13 maximum reps per set or three minimum. Those aforementioned are the rules of the General War Integrated Total Body Training System, of which yours truly has created in this room of St. Temple in October 2019. As a world peace advocate and was alarmed by what was transpiring in the world up to that moment in time, namely the US-China trade war started by Donald Trump administration, the diplomatic political crisis between Canada and China by the detainment arrest of Meng Wanzhou and the RCMP to honor an extradition treaty with the United States and the consequent arrest and detainment of two nationals from Canada, citizens Michael Spav or Michael Kovrig. I was saying in my mind, my heart as a world peace advocate, an independent artist, athlete and activist, saying, my goodness, this Donald Trump administration with this trade war and what's going on in the world, the world is set on a path to World War III. So yours truly world peace advocate, but also student, scholar of history, Student scholars of military scenarios, student scholar of warfare, has, after having been about 15 months up to that point in time, November, October 2019, have decided to create a workout that will go hand in hand with a scenario, a World War III scenario. And this is the workout. Up to that moment in time, October 2019, I've experimented with different workouts techniques right in this room of St. Temple. I've, by that moment, October 2019, I've lost about 60 pounds up to then. So then I said I was going to do something new and was alarmed. I was going to combine world peace advocacy with my workout. And so I've created this new workout called General War Integrated Total Body Training System. Those seven words translate as the 300 workout. From those seven words, of course, you can see, detect the essence core of the workout. General war integrated, meaning it's an integration in a war state, a crisis, a World War III scenario. And of course, it's ongoing because the timeline of the World War III scenario ends in July. In parallel with our timeline, in the paradoxical providential parallel way, of course. 93 days later after my scenario, the COVID-19 health and financial crisis struck. And of course, it's still ongoing and still many parts of the world are still in a crisis. Health, although with recoveries on the way. Now my trinity on COVID has been, is and will be this. First and foremost, I do not know what caused COVID. Second, I believe it was snakes to human beings who transmitted it, although others believe it was bats, other people say some sort of other animals, whatever. So let's say animals, although I believe it was snakes, could be bats, animals to human transmission. But third, since I don't know for sure, and there's still doubt and there's still research, that Trinity is, first and foremost, I don't know what caused COVID. Second, I believe it was snakes to human beings that caused COVID. And since I do not know 100%, and there's a doubt, in my belief of what caused COVID in reality, in truth, I cannot rule out another possibility being an accident in a laboratory, an experiment gone wrong, or even, of course, a, a biological weapon. And 
and so on and so forth, other possibilities. So that trinity, don't know, think it was snakes, cannot rule out another possibility. And there's a fourth dimension to that trinity, what do know, 100%, without any doubt whatsoever, is that before COVID, in October 2019, about 93 days before COVID, yours truly world peace advocate and independent artist, athlete and activist, created this scenario to go hand in hand with a World War III scenario based on the geopolitical state, on the factors that were the state of the world in October 2019. So that I know 100%. So I created this scenario to go hand in hand with this workout. And the scenario is a World War III scenario, which includes a, included and includes a stock market crash that caused a global financial collapse, which was blamed by many, including China, North Korea, and the US. Uh, trade administration and the imposition of tariffs, the trade war. And thus, there was a surprise attack in the fictitious scenario on the North American West Coast by China, North Korea. In Canada, US and Mexico. That was the scenario. It was based on what had transpired up to that moment in time. And I was basing it also on the Pearl Harbor event, December 7th, 1941. So based on those historical factors, I've created this scenario to go hand in hand with this workout, which I've created, which would be a total body training workout system designed to be creative and effective and efficient. And of course, you know, paradoxical providential parallel way, 93 days later, COVID-19 hit the world, triggering a health and financial crisis. And since that paradox, my scenario was seeing and offering and proposing and envisioning this scenario to have solutions to World War III and for defensive, offensive, neutral capabilities. I've, of course, and began July 24th, 2020 to advocate call for the creation of what I was envisioning and in that scenario because it wasn't just a surprise attack and global financial collapse there's more to it I'm calling for in real life for the creation of how I was envisioning it in the scenario the international citizen integrated social security force aka the dragon army from amalgamizing creating one percent from all willingly loving citizens of Canada US Mexico our allies throughout Central South America NATO, North Atlantic Treaty Organization, Israel, the world, Africa, and beyond the Middle East, from the East extending the hand of peace for the West, and to create, to secure food, housing, and transport for all. Once we have those three secured, we'll be able to meet the next COVID pandemic, if it so hits collectively as a global civilization. And of course, we'll be able to encourage people to work out, train, volunteer, do exercise, keep community working. Keep the hygienic protocols in the public domain of the dancing goddess and the dragon empire who are one. Wash, 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 see. Pack, pack, pack. Soap, soap, soap. Rub, 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 rub. Rub, 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 rub. See what's soap. Soap disinfected. Rub clean hands and disinfect. And we're gonna keep the health. I'm hoping that we're gonna keep when we go in the public. You're washing your hands when you go inside a building, when you go to retrieve goods, items, etc. Wash when you go in and when you go out. It's a few seconds, you can do it on the go. It does in fact because we carry these germs, we carry microbes, we carry of course all sorts of bacteria. So that is the scenario, that was the scenario, it's ongoing, that's why in the real life I'm advocating and calling for the creation of the Dragon Army, officially titled International Citizen Integrated Social Security Force, in a paradoxical way, since of course my scenario was fictitious, but it's, there's much more to it, which I'm going to discuss with others willingly, and of course, one by, by one basis, since in my scenario, there was of course the solution to create this new institution. National Citizen Integrated Social Security Force for create a new world order of world peace, international freedom, global security, and universal love and justice by a public-private partnership from all existing public and private security forces, local national police forces, armed forces, 
amalgamating to be securing the three elements of civilization. Those three elements of civilization are food, housing, and transport. With those secured food and easy, easy mobility to go with different transit and different housing to be able to change it intermittently during intervals of periods of time. And encourage people to work out, train, volunteering, working out, training, exercising has been, is, and will be medicine of choice for yours truly. Now, I tested three times negative. Two weeks ago, I tested COVID. Go get tested, get tested, get tested. I tested three times negative for COVID. Last two weeks, two months ago, and back in October 2020. A year after my workout, this workout, the Joe Ward, the Great Old Body Training System began. I tested three times negative. I'm going to get my jab at the end of this week. Actually, the beginning of the week of the Dragon, which is Sunday. I'm going to get the jab. I'm going to get the vaccine. But I think I had COVID. Because right before it was a lot in the news, right before about 37 days before it was declared a pandemic by the WHO, the World Health Organization, because at the end of January, I felt ill, sick, and disease, like was pestilence, death, and disease in my body. Thought I was gonna die. Up until February 20th. On February 20th, I started, I was, started healing, rising again. February 20th was so. February 20th, that I was healed. Right? In many ways, Adrian H. The dragon did die. With every step, every push-up, every hawk, every squat, every dancing move that I bust. I am being reborn as yours truly, Adrian Hana Dragon. Dragon Zero, Priestess, Hana of the Dancing Goddess Empire. Who is, of course, the one with the Dragon Empire under the sun. The Dancing Goddess and the Dragon Empire are one under the sun. Under the stars on earth, both complementary cooperative missions, vision, and philosophies for world peace, international justice, global freedom, and universal love by securing food, housing, and transport for all by the Dragon Army and creating the complementary parallel institution of the International Integrated Dance League. Integrated that will be in all gender, all ages, all sexual orientation, inclusive. Both empires, of course, under the sun are one empire under the sun, dancing goddess and dragon empire, non sectarian. Dance League to organize mass dancing events in order to mass finance the cleaning of the oceans, rivers, waterways, lakes, forests, etc. I'm gonna go get the bottle of water in a few seconds. very important super important extremely important is hydration this bottle is 710 milliliters of water which i strongly recommend for anybody who's doing the general war integral body training system to drink while doing it 710 milliliters water is this bottle right here 710 which i will be drinking this 188th session of the General War Integrated Total Body Training System is dedicated to my friend, oftentimes teacher, the one I love and call sister. Well, it's a fourth dimension to Trinity of sister, friend, teacher, to being for the moment my only financial sponsor. Actually, she's the one who is going to be anonymous, but got my got filters for me to drink pure, cleaner, healthier water which I am drinking thanks to getting the filters that she sponsors but yours truly Adrian H dragon being reborn this is a special full moon lots of dancing in this one full moon coming in a few hours in Hawk Island Montreal full moon for the goddess and the dragon empire one empire under the sun both complementary missions vision and philosophies your stool, Adrian H. Dragon being reborn with every step, every push up, every hawk, every squat that I'm doing every step. Now that we're warming up, I'm gonna get into it. So, again, the rules of the general war integrated total body training system are this you have to do, and this, of course, applies to everybody who is.
everybody. Everybody who is willingly loving to become a... A dragon. Peacekeeping soldier. That includes all existing public and private security forces, all existing armed forces. All the Canada, US, NATO, even General is high fi the one what stars. You gotta be able to do a general war to get a body training system within these rules. Nobody is born a dragon. It's the model of the dragon. You become one to blood, sweat, tears, push-ups, hot sweat, admitting your struggles. I struggled a lot across the great desert, was suicidal, depressed. Actually, just this morning was moody, moody, a little bit, did a little bit of Instagram, this and that, felt a little bit moody. So what has worked, what is working and what will work for me is working out, training, exercise, and understanding the feelings, admitting them, the hidden fears, lust, etc., 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 channeling it, the aggression, the force, channeling it via love and understanding of one's nature. One's inclination, person, experience, etc., 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 channeling it and doing. Of course, working out, training, exercising for me has been, is, and will be medicine of choice. I believe it is for many. Since I only embarked on my fitness journey, have been advocating and still am calling NFL, National Football League, NHL, National Hockey League, NBA, National Basketball Association, Major League Baseball, Soccer Leagues, who are multi millionaires, athletes averaging millions of dollars in salaries since 1984. Your time, brothers and sisters, brothers, mostly, of course, is patriarchal leagues. And I have to say, Dancing Goddess League, of course, is the one to balance patriarchal sports leagues for the creation of the International Citizen Integrated Dance League. Dancing Goddess Army. This is special full moon workout, warm up and up. Let's do some squats. Tell the leaders of the free world Dragon Zero's message. Drop down, give Dragon Zero 13 push ups with love and for the sake of world peace. Good job, Mark and March. Mark and March. So I already start feeling a bit better. Working out, training, exercising has been, is, and will be medicine and therapy for yours truly. I believe it is so for many, but we need real action, public private partnership, especially from the sports leagues aforementioned that I said. National Hockey League, National Basketball Association, National Football League, MLB, Major League Baseball, European Soccer since 1984. Yeah, I've been making millions of dollars averaging salaries for NFL. It's a few million. NHL is 6.6 .6 million average salary. Some make 10, 11 million dollars a year. Trying with a puck. Have this and that. And to give especially to the youth. Mass finance the youth, incentivize them. Workout, train, exercise. The mission of the Dragon Empire. Great Dragon Army. Throw the streets XYZ perimeters. Make sure these three elements of civilization are secured for all, independent of any other considerations. For all allies, citizens, subjects of the Dragon Goddess and the Dragon Empire, or one empire under the sun. Three elements of civilization food, housing, and transport. And then we can encourage people to have transport if the big cities like Montreal, Hawk Island is a big island surrounded by one of the biggest rivers in the world, 3.7 million people. And people can move a few kilometers to go with the transport if they have to do some volunteering, community work, etc. etc. Learn to do that. Let's go, Hawks. This is a hawk. You become the hawk. You go on the toes, you spread your wings, fly high on the toes. We go turn your hawk heads east, west, north, south, up and down. This is the hawk exercise. H A W K. Hawk, hawk, hawk. Turn your hawk heads east, west, north, south, up and down. See? And you go on the toes as a ballerina ballet. You propel your body up while simultaneously you spread your wings in 180 degree circular motion, just like you saw me doing. 
that is a hawk. The hawk exercise, of course, trains the feet, the toes, the ankles, the laterals, the neck, the push up, mostly the chest, the core, and the arms. Although many other muscles are integrated when you do the push up, which I'm going to do next. Switch this cap, otherwise, it'll bang into the floor. Push up, many muscles are integrated in the push up, but mainly the chest, core, and arms. And of course, the squat, you get the thighs. You get the ties or the peach. So these three simple, effective, efficient exercises that requires no equipment. Push up, hocks, squats. Design, of course, would be a total body, head to toe training system. Training system. These three, you have three, you have a system. Push up, squats, hocks. The trinity of push up, hocks, squats, or the total body which the more you do it, the more will increase your natural strength, natural lean, 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 natural muscle, strength, power, muscle building. Not necessarily the aesthetics that much, but more the core, the strength, the force, the, the strength, natural lean strength, strength and athleticism, those three. And the fourth dimension to the trinity of push-up, squats, hocks, is you integrate the cardio, because the cardio is integrated, right? Keep in mind, this workout was created to go hand in hand with the World War III scenario, right? Let's say we introduce the lion craft. And the dragon arm it needs to secure what? It needs to secure what? It needs to secure what? The three elements of civilization for all independent, non sectarian of all other considerations food, housing, and transport, and in the public domain of the Dancing Goddess and the Dragon Empire, I encourage people to work out, train, exercise in the public domain, do whatever needs to be done, brotherly, sisterly, love, dance, 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 and rub, 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 soap, let's go, push-ups, No, that was more than 10, but I'm gonna mark it as 10 anyways. And I do a little bit of extra this full moon first workout, first session of the week. The Dancing Goddess and the Dragon Week runs from Sunday to Friday midnight at midnight for the Dancing Goddess and the Dragon Empire who are one empire under the sun, under the stars on earth. This is the Sabbath, 37 hour, 49 minute, 42 second, almost 48, uh, almost 38. Almost 38, almost 38. Not exactly, almost 38. Our Sabbath, Dancing Goddess, Dragon Sabbath and Phoenix. Sabbath for the recreation, rejuvenation, recreation, pleasure, joy of the Dancing Goddess and the Dragon Empire youth. Not only the youth, but everybody, all citizens, allies, subjects, support us. Organize mass dancing events from Friday, starting in Hawk Island, Montreal, Friday, and then throughout the world. Wherever you are, my children, get ready for some squats. Squats in five. Let's go, squats, squats. Good job, squat, squats. Mark March and hydrate. H Y D R A T E. Dragon Army, follow me. H Y D R A T E means what? Hydrate with me. Seven ten milliliter bottle. Do rock recommend to rock it up your rock it in your belly. 710 milliliters filtered thanks to my friend after times teacher one I love go sister who provided the filters <sighs> 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 
Get ready for some hawks. Hawks in five. Yes, I am barefoot. Let's go. Hawks, fly high, spread your wings to the sky. Call Elon Musk. Say Elon Musk, brother B. Musk, dragon space crash for the dragon. Empire for world peace. B. Musk, hawk us in the sky. To this new craft or the old dragon craft. Space us up. Space Dragon Zero up with the crew, some there for world peace in the International Space Station. Hawk, spread your wings, ballet up on the toes. We go feet, turn your hawk heads east, west, north, south, up and down. Good job, Mark and March. Mark and March. Let's bust the dance move. The dancing goddess. Empire was one with the dragon empire. By the Phoenix People's Party, the anti war, anti poverty, anti racism, pro universal love. Universal revolutionary centrist party. Universal that is global, international, worldwide. And revolutionary centrist that's not fascist, not communist, not extreme left or right. But in the center, making the compromise, cooperative covenant, compromise, cooperative covenant, compromise, cooperative covenant, public private partnership, securing the three elements of civilization food, housing, and transport. Once you have those three secured, we can build a global civilization from there and allocate resources to citizenry, Sarawak internet connection to dance, love, exercise, workout, keep hygienic, hygiene, 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 dragons, we can get dirty. But we gotta get back clean because if you stay dirty, stay filthy, breathe germs, bacteria, disease. I wanna be healthy in mind, body, and spirit. All willingly loving, join me. This quest for world peace, international security, global freedom, and universal justice. Push ups. Job, Mark and March. <laughs> feel good. Already feel better. It's feeling a bit moody, moody, a bit angry. But I've been through, been through a lot since a child, adolescent, out of life, struggle, pain, suffering, depression, suicide was suicidal for years, was repressed. Repressed my bisexuality, homoerotic desires. Erectional homoerotic desires for more than 13.3 years. 13.3, 13.3 years was not out of the closet. Just years ago, almost seven years ago. So I was openly bisexual, pansexual, androgynous. Things is understanding how we feel, feelings important as emotions, as the irrational subconscious, in parallel complementary, as important to logic, mathematics, and rationality. As I always say, there is no God without the Goddess. Squats! Feel good. Good job, squats. Squat, squat, squat. Wipe off sweat and it be. Bust the dance move really for the moon shoes. Full moon special. Dedicated to the mission, vision, and philosophy of the dancing goddess and the dragon empire or one empire of the sun. See the red dragon emblem and the 
that's in goddess empire where one empire emblem and the goddess dances with her brother the sun to make create and produce all their little fruits vegetables and legumes that our brothers and sisters farmers harvest and that even yours truly appreciate and then I'm offering the farmers local national international hand washes feet washes massages where I realized how fucking FFF useless can we be millennial like me since and food right and housing to build civilization do love offer work volunteer learn grow do art because I'm an artist as well of course you can do a little bit of rapping a little bit of singing dancing chanting theater rope play of course screenplays etc 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 get ready for hawks hawks now fly high propel body up to the sky turn your hawk heads east west north south Good job, Mark and March. Hawks. Hawks are us. Dragon Elon Musk. Anybody got Elon Musk's phone numbers, personal text, email, whatever? I'm a fan. I gotta say, I'm a fan and admirer of Elon Musk. My, as a child, 19, 96, 97, 98, 11, 12, 13, my path diverged path diverged my path diverged as a young child of about 11 12 13 because a nerd still am at heart very much a nerd but diverged into xyz struggle suffered had not the privilege of being born with a silver spoon i've struggled financially as a child etc 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 all sorts of struggles but i would have been probably a good nerd and a good tech innovator science by these computers would have been a great spiel for me and i just imagined everything that was ever typed since 1984 my birth in november till now let's go who said the imagination is greater than knowledge if you made it this far I didn't bother you too much. Answer me the question. That one who answers me the question first, who said this? Imagination is greater than knowledge. Who said imagination is greater than knowledge? Then you get a special blessing, special offer of kisses, massage, hugs, washing of the feet, whatever, etc. 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 Push-ups. good so back like I said my path would have diverged to science innovation technology I'm a fan of how satellites works a fan of believe it or not <laughs> it's not that much science but I love cranes you know cranes those cranes yeah cranes that build the big blocks for us to be able to do build the skyscrapers we need cranes right the cranes is a major factor and the paradox i don't know it all i don't know what caused COVID i think with snakes like i said i don't know who built the pyramids i have a little bit of theory like many people do but we don't know for sure nobody paradox can say for sure who built the pyramids just like you read chapter genesis 50 or genesis 32 or Genesis 37, you're like, wow, there's a great mystery to this. We got the real answers. Truth in the fiction and some fiction in the truth. Squats.
good job marking March. Ah, oh, I feel good. Ah, oh, I feel really good. Ah. But it's locked that I don't know. I'm a universal spiritual teaching student because I still learn every day, especially from children. Children teach me a lot. Although I love reading books to children, young children teach me a lot. And the anthem of the dancing goddess and the dragon emperor and the phoenix people's body is we have music combined, fused classical music with rock, rap, rock, techno. But uh, there's no lyrics. It's just children laughing, giggling, and playing. That's it. That's the anthem of the dragon and the dancing goddess empire. One empire and the sun and the stars on earth. So back to science, technology, and innovation. Diverged. I am learning Chinese for world peace, though. And a little bit of computer science. A little bit, my path diverged. It's never too late to learn any subject, I believe. But then, anyways, on Elon Musk, I admire SpaceX, PayPal. I admire the interest in how exactly it works with applications. Right now, I'm able to live stream on Facebook through the Wi-Fi, which has the hardware and an equipment, which the hardware and the software go together. And of course, I'm able to live stream perhaps to anybody that is on Facebook in order to could be able to potentially see, of course, everything perhaps with a few seconds delays. But nonetheless, get ready for Hawk. So Elon Musk, brother, I want to know how those sat little satellites you launch. I want to know more about them. Starlink, Starlink, Starlink. And it's super cool, man. Good job. Elon Musk, Bill Gates, Mark Zuckerberg, and of course, others get free lifetime massages. We are Stulias, my allies and armies do. Ah, kisses. One more. Ah, one more. Ah, yeah. ah, I'm going a little bit of hydration. Hydrate. H Y D R A T. Dragon Army, follow me. H Y D R A T E. What does it mean? It means open the bottle, drink with me. push-ups push-ups in five Some good push-ups. Good push-ups. Good job, good job, good job, good job, good job. Get the job, get the job, get the job, good job, good job, good job, get the job, get the job, get the job. Wow. Again, my trinity on COVID first. I don't know what caused COVID second. I believe it was snakes, the human beings third. I don't know for sure. My belief is now 100 percent confirmed. I cannot rule out another possibility, X, Y, Z, be it accident in a lab experiment gone wrong, bioweapon, but the fourth dimension to that trinity on COVID, what I do know 100% without a doubt is that before COVID 93 days, yours will have to been about 15 months up to 
that moment in time on my fitness journey I've created, made and produced this workout right here. Effective, efficient, simple, it was required no equipment to go hand in hand with a World War III scenario and was to be de facto for the army force troops of the in that scenario that I created which is ongoing now a timeline begins June and then ends, <gasps> ends in July and what I do know is that it's perfect for COVID and that it resembles COVID and of course I offer the solution in that scenario and thus I'm advocating for integration in real life the Dragon Army, aka officially titled the International Citizen Integrated Social Security Force, to secure the three elements of civilization, food, housing, and transport for all, by a public private partnership, and the, the creation of the Global Central Bank by the Phoenix People's Party to create the two institutions of the Dancing Goddess and the Dragon Army, by what I call Biometrics, a parallel global currency, by my theory of debt refusion, taking all public and private debt, refusing it to create and finance these institutions. Set to zero debt by the hand and the eye and the voice are unique biometrics. And so to do it by that. But first, of course, securing food, housing, and transport. I need to go hand in hand together. Let's go squats. So we have secured those three and encourage people to work out, train, volunteer, clean, 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 clean. Make love, make love, love. Massage, learn, grow. Three more, three. Ah. Ah, one more, one more. Ah. Good job, Mark and March. And wipe off sweat. Negative thoughts, negative thoughts. It's a struggle, it can be a struggle. But in itself, of course, it's sublimating, channeling the energies, right? And of course, discerning, asking questions, that's not asking. That's what the Dancing Goddess and the Dragon Empire is for. Harmony, a new cooperative covenant between the public and the private. Although, of course, I opened a little bit of my private life, a little bit, a little tiny window. I am more perhaps weird, strange, odd in my personal life than I open my window to the world. But of course, you can also just be private, the public and the private. So, in the Dancing Goddess and the Dragon Empire domain, local, national, international, under the sun, under the stars on earth, in the public. in the public the responsibility and rights to clean keep hygienic and go in public buildings being clean let's go hawks 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 Kids, east, west, north, south, up and down, left or right. One more, one more. Oh, yeah. Spread your wings. Good job, Mark and March. Wipe off sweat. Hydrate H Y D R A T E. Dragon Army, drink with me. Hydrate. Stormy days, stormy weather coming in the coming seconds, minutes, and hours in Hawk Island, Montreal. Thunderstorms in the forecast. Although yours truly, paradoxically. Loves the sun, sunny, sunny, sunny days can get sun, 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 sun. I turn fast, but I also paradoxically love 
thunder and lightning and storms just as I love a clear beautiful sky beautiful white cloud sky blue sky and golden sun and it's one of those perfect summer days as much as I love a good November storm push-ups Good job, Mark. March, get ready to do some more squats. Bust the dance move. Full moon, bust the dance move. Groove. You do. Then you take a shower after the workout, have lunch. Then do a full moon cleaning, purifying, rotating room, room off some tempo. Ready for squats, squats. Good job, Mark and March. Get ready for some hot. Five. Ten. Make it ten to make sure we get the minimum what? Minimum thirty-one second count. Rules are simple. You gotta do one hundred push-ups, one hundred squats, one hundred hocks. That Trinity hocks push-up squats, one hundred reps each, but maximum thirteen reps per set. Minimum three or anywhere in between. Do seven, six, do ten like me, or thirteen and three. It's not regimented, you can play along with, but between each set of whatever reps you do, 13 max, three minimum, or anywhere in between, there's a minimum of what? 31 second. That's half a minute. Plus one second marching, jogging, walking fast pace, like I'm doing marching steps, right? More of a marching steps, hard steps. Like rock jar. Let's go, hacks. Good job, Mark and March. Mark and March. Mark and March.
get ready for push-ups push-ups in 10 bust the dance move push-ups let's go push-ups Fun. H Y D R A T. Dragon Army. Get ready for squats. Squats in five. Make it ten. Make sure we get a 31 second minimum count. Let's go squats. Yes, yes, yes. Good job. Good job. Get ready for some hawks. Hawks in 10. Three, two, one, fly high, spread your wings, hawks. To the sky on the toes, we go ballerina up. You know, hot kids go east, west, north, south, up and down, west, right, east, left, up and down. One more. And again, again. Ha! Ah, oh, oh yeah, that felt good. That felt really good. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, my palm sweat. Push-ups in five. Push-ups.
Good job, Mark and March. Mark and March. Hydrate H Y D R A T E Dragon Army, follow me, hydrate. Now get ready for the squat. Squats in five. Squat. One more, one more. Ah, that feel good. Squat. 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 You ready for hops? in 10 On the toes, spread your wings, fly, fly, fly high. And again. Oh. Oh. Ah, one more. Oh, yeah. That felt good. Get ready for some squat, some push-ups, push-ups in five. I mean, you can do whatever, but now I'm gonna be doing push-ups. Whoever has entered the Dragon's Lair, you are invited to 
push-ups, squats, hocks, or busting a dance move, stretch. Encourage you to exercise, work out, train, or at least do some push-ups for world peace. If not, tell the leaders of the free world Dragon Zero's message. Drop down. Give Dragon Zero 13 push-ups with love and for the sake of world peace. Yeah, that was more than 10, I was like 13, but the market is 10. A little bit of extra. Oh yeah. Now hydrate again. H-Y-D-R-A-D-E. Dragon Army, drink with me. in 10 One more. Good job, Mark and March. Ready for some hawks to fly high. Call Elon Musk, say brother. Dragon Zero requires some technical assistance, and uh, need to beat us up on those star crafts that you call Dragon because we Dragon and Dragon Zero, and we the Dragon Army. Ooh. We drop down for some hawks. Nobody's born a dragon. You can be an ally, citizen, supporter, the mission, vision, and philosophy, but not even yours truly born Adrian H. Dragon, which you have every step, every push up, every squat, every hawk. When you were born as yours truly, Adrian, Ahana, dragon, androgynous, founder of the dancing goddess in the dragon empire, who won empire under the sun. And of course, the motto is of the dragon that nobody is born a dragon. You become one through blood, sweat, and tears, push up, hawks, squats, exercise, and pain, blood, suffering. Hawks! Fly high, toe up to the sky, spread your wings 180 degrees, turn your hawk heads east, west, north, south, up and down.
Uh, again, again, again. Oh, one more. Get ready for some P U S H U P S for some push ups. Get ready for some push ups and then we hydrate. Push ups in five. Good job. Mark in March. Wipe off sweat. Ah. Opa. Opa. Ah. And hydrate. Hydrate. See, seven ten milliliter bottle, which will be for we drank right now. Only a bit left, anyways. Yeah, 710. See, that's what I recommend for every session of the General War Integrated Body Training System. Those seven words in those 300 workout. That's what I have been. I just am and will drink. And that's proportional workout. Good hydration, perhaps it's a bit on the extra. 500 milliliters would probably be sufficient, but. Hydration is important. Squats in five. Actually, last sets of squats, right? We're done. Yeah. There we are. Squats in five, four, three, two, one. Squats. Good job, Mark and March. So that is 100. And if not, the informal rule of three, if I lose count, I'm gonna uh, add three to make sure. Ah, that felt good. Whew. See, there's three phases to the general war integrated body training system, aka the 300 workout. So the first phase is from the first session first phase is the birth and the growth 
which is the first session to the 100 session. The second phase is the super growth, super development, which is from the 100 session to the 200 session of which I'm, this is my 180th session. So I am in a period of a super development and super growth for 20 more. And then the third phase will be moderate or stable growth. And after 300 sessions, well, most will probably reach a plateau and you will have to add something, a backpack or add something to it. But until then, the muscles still develop, still grow, still feel it. Because this is my 180th session and I still feel the pain and the pull when I do it. Because otherwise you wouldn't, I really wouldn't be effective anymore, but I still feel it. And when I do again three in a row, like, I usually do, I'm trying to, it's minimum three per week, maximum six. I don't recommend six, I did it once and I was really sore, six in a row, I did it. And this, the next day, after having done six in a row, I was really sore, 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 sore. It's feasible, but it's a lot of, it's try it for yourself. You gotta try it for yourself within the rules and and then you can, you can, you can talk, you can say. And of course, if you do it once and you say, yeah, it's not for me, blah, blah then whatever but if you do it more times you're gonna see of course you're not gonna see the results after you do 10 sessions you're gonna have to do this my 180th but nonetheless it's an exercise lean muscle growth development and we're gonna be ready for hoxing five and it's lean because it's natural muscle building agility strength agility overall fitness and if you increase the cardio you lose weight or maintain weight so this is the three phases Let's go. Oh, you know, high heads, west, east, up and down, left to right. First phase, zero for the, from the first session to the 100. Second phase from the 100 to the 200. And third phase from the 200 to the 300. I'm in the 180, so I'm in the second phase, which is the super growth, super development. Because after you do it more than 100 times, after that, the second phase, you unleash a natural lean muscle growth. You might even grow a few inches since you do the right, this exercise that I'm doing here. Hawk, you go on the toes as a ballerina, you might grow even two or three inches. Even in your 30s, even 40s. This exercise might, of course not, but if you do this, will increase your strength. Lean, lean, natural muscle mass. Not necessarily, like I said, aesthetics. But strength, overall strength. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Hawks come. Pleated. On left. Push ups. And that will be, of course, the successful completion of the 180th session of the General War Integrated Total Body Training System, which the first session was October 17th. 2019 right here in this room office and temple my fourth dimension to this underground literally underground space which is my room has been for the past few years my office my room i write poetry ideas for scripts for the paradoxical providential final birth of the dancing goddess and the dragon empire and yours truly being reborn as Adrian Hanna Dragon, androgynous founder of the Dancing Goddess and the Dragon Empire, and the Phoenix People's Party, the world peace, international security, global freedom, and universal love and justice. Push-ups in 10. So in this room of St. Temple, to the trinity of this underground space of temple, office and room I was added a fourth dimension of a gymnasium. It began three years ago or so with the World Citizens Gym. You can see on my YouTube, on Facebook, 
from about two and a half years ago, to more than two years ago, workouts of some are three hours long. You see your truly Adrian H Dragon, at 277 pounds, and no neck. I was really overweight, in my opinion. I am body positive, I am body positive, but, and accepting of them, but I've struggled with weight, I've struggled with weight, and depression and suicidal, so it has been, is it will be medicine and therapy for me. Push ups. Is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 100 push ups for the successful completion of the 180th session of the General War Integrated Total Body Training System. By yours truly, who has entered the Dragon's Lair? You are welcome, invited, and encouraged to do some push ups, squats, hocks, or take some marching steps for well peace. And if not, or so we pass the message of Dragon Zero's message to the leaders of the free world. Tell the leaders of the free world to drop down. Give Dragon Zero 13 push-ups with love and for the sake of world peace. One hundred eighty down, one hundred twenty to go. Every step, every push up, every hug, every squat, every dancing move, yours truly. Adrian H. Dragon is being reborn as yours truly. Dragonus, founder of the Dancing Goddess and the Dragon Empire for world peace. Love you.